God bless you. I'm Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr., pastor of the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. I'm also the prelate of North Carolina Third Ecclesiastical Jurisdiction. I want to speak to you just for a moment about a marvelous thing that is happening in our jurisdiction. The Church of God in Christ Academy of the Third Ecclesiastical Jurisdiction in the state of North Carolina is an awesome, awesome academy. Let me tell you, we are focusing on training our students to have a biblical, practical, and theological worldview. It is important at uh, our academy that you know how to accurately handle the word of truth. It is important that the students understand how to make the Bible relevant in the times in which we live. There is nothing, there is nothing like the Word of God. There is, there is no greater gift that God has given to mankind than His Word. But if the Word is not understood, if the Word is not accurately handled, if the Word is not properly applied, then all of the blessings that are in the Word of God for you and me, my friends, we will not realize them. I believe that too many Christians live their entire life uh, with Christ. They walk with Jesus throughout this earthly sojourn and they never get what God actually has for them while they, they're here because many times too many Christians do not know how to accurately handle the word of truth. They don't know how to view the contemporary and the practical and even the novel things that are going on in their world through the lenses of the scripture. I've often said this, the Bible is more current than tomorrow morning's newspaper, but it won't be for you if you don't know how to uh, understand it, if you don't know how to accurately apply it. At the North Carolina Third Academy, we are training Christian men and women to be apologists for Jesus Christ, not to apologize for the gospel, but to be apologists, that, that is, defenders of God's truth. We want our students to stand on the Word of God and know the difference between the Bible and traditional sayings. We want our students to be able to say, the Bible says thus and so, and it's actually in the scriptures, and we're actually using it in context. And my friends, we are training people to do just that. Our Dean, Dr. Yvonne Watford McKinney, is doing a tremendous job leading this effort in North Carolina third ecclesiastical jurisdiction. I invite you to give us a look. I invite you from all over the jurisdiction, from everywhere my voice is heard and this is seen, from every Christian Reformation to take a look at North Carolina Third. Join our academy, attend the classes, whether they are online or in person. Commit yourself to a semester, commit yourself to this work and I guarantee you, you will walk away blessed of the Lord and highly favored. And I can promise you, you will walk away with a greater understanding of, the, of one of the greatest gifts that God gave to the human race. I say one of the greatest gifts because he gave us the gift of his son. He gave us the gift of the Holy Ghost. He has given you and me the gift of life. But the meaning to these gifts the, 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 the road map, if you will, the GPS, the thing that's necessary to understand these gifts is the gift of the Bible. God put this miraculous, marvelous book together. Oh my, over 1600 years, multiple authors, most of which never met one another. And God compiled it and watched over his word and he gave us academies. The, and one of them is the North Carolina Third Ecclesiastical Jurisdiction Academy to teach people how to accurately handle the word of God, the word of truth. I challenge you, I invite you, I beseech you, I implore you, join North Carolina Third Academy and be blessed as a result of it. Thank you very much.